Uh, Ken Ward's work is deceptively simple, but under closer examination, one begins to see subtle shifts in color that happen as, oh, as shapes overlap, slight texture that you have to get up really close to see, and also some very interesting movements, almost waltz-like movements. Uh, Ken's work is contemplative. It's the kind of piece that, you, that really deserves a lot of time in the same sense that a Rothko might. You have to examine every, every inch of this to understand how he is combining color, how he is overlapping color, how he is creating space. And um, his consistency is really interesting too because I look at all his, th all his work and I see similar kinds of you know, swooping shapes, but each is different. He, he has so many um, uh, permutations of these swooping shapes that they probably could go on forever, and he could probably come up with combinations that, that are unceasing. <laughs>